And we should be back. I hate how PlayStation cuts out like that. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, we gotta welcome all the new people. We've gotta welcome all the new family. We've got Gilbert. We've got Big Abe Furry. <laughs> welcome, guys. Um, let's get... Let's get my best friend in here. As soon as I remember how the fuck to set up a PlayStation party. Start party. Close party. Alright. I've started the party. It's always a party here. You'll like Abe. He's got a cat named Hen- <gasps> Oh! Abe! I had a cat named Henry. He was like the sweetest black and white tuxedo. Um, we unfortunately lost him to cancer two years ago. Um, but yeah, no, he, he was a beautiful little rescue baby that I rescued from, uh, the ASPCA. That's where I got him. He had been with this old woman who died under mysterious circumstances. By mysterious circumstances, they were pretty sure the cat tripped her down the stairs. <laughs> And, yeah, <laughs> that's how we ended up with Movie Night Shared Story. We're doing Pass the Wireless Controller and Play the Story Together, supporting two to five friends. Okay, so I guess Movie Night's if we're in the same room. Join group. I don't want... Yes, I want, I want, why? I hate PlayStation's notification system. You already joined. Creating session. There we go. Right? Yeah. All right, Joe, just hop in the, I wonder how we connect audio. You joined the PlayStation party that I sent you an invite to. And that, that's how you, you get into chat. Did, did you forget how to join? You have to join the voice chat, sir. Alright, I guess we're doing this without the freaking voice chat. Let's just all take a deep I joined. breath and not lose you our You didn't. Lives. You joined the game. You this have to go into notifications the way, and, now and join. It's scary. Okay. Pause. I will send you another invite, but the game invite and the chat invite are- Hey! Uh, hey. Uh, <laughs> you and Julia, I swear! The two of you! Lax. I'm serious. Everything about this is off. Kills me to admit it. That Kate is right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we had that hate rate issue. I could probably turn that off. I know what I saw. In the dark. You think I'm making this up? Everyone relax, okay? Just give me a second to think. They should be allowed to talk now unrestricted. Excuse you. And exit stage left are oh so confident and sure leader. What was that? <laughs> Joe, why are you kicking a wall? Thinking. She looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? 
What? I'm just I've saying. I've been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something. Anything. And now this is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? Sorry, maybe I'm crazy, but if Aaron says somebody came for her, I believe her. We're not safe here. It was just a dummy. You think I'm lying? Really? I think maybe you're just confused about what you saw in the dark. I know what I saw. Right. Here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's leaving. Just listen. We cannot jump to conclusions. I'm going to go and find Dumet and get clear on everything. Everything is going to be fine, okay? And we're going to get the footage we need. He didn't show for dinner. What makes you think you can find him now? A positive attitude. You should try it sometime. Wifey! Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Dumet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? In this I series, as far yes. As Charlie ideas go, it's not Why the worst Charlie he's ever had. Like it's not even the worst idea I've had to see. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are fucked. Whatever. Aww, I'm, I'm sorry, wifey. I'm if Wait, I was there, I would give you, you lots of go? hugs. Be right back. Promise. Just stay put so I know where to find you, okay? I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my shit together. Kate. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? I liked it because they didn't like. Aaron saw someone. Okay, you're right. Sorry. It's just Charlie said. I got you, babe. Safe here. That outweighs having a damn job. You're right. Let's go, Aaron. Everything's gonna be okay. Wait here. Can't you just stay here while I pack up my stuff? I don't want to waste any time. I'm right around the corner. Let's all be quick. We'll be right back. I promise. So, Chad, who's, who's gonna die first? No, don't. Uh, sorry, just still freaked out. Can you leave it open so you guys can hear me? Of course. Okay, I'm sorry, but Aaron said this is a book. She is! I'd date her. Okay, genius. Where are we going to look first for Dumet? I'm not looking for Dumet. I'm scared. Oh, sweet! Dogs. You're the old man, I'm the lesbian. That makes perfect sense. Jesus. You really don't care about anything else, do you? Of course I care. All right. You know as well as I do, if we're set up and a camera is rolling, she'll want to be in front of it. <sighs> Asshole. All right. Well, everybody, do you know what time it is here? It's time to find secrets. I found a secret. Good evening. Thank you for allowing me to contact. Okay, we've read this before, but on the back, thanks for... Mr. Graham, thanks, I'd be delighted to come along. Uh, oh, this is from Joe Morello, the, the guy that we think is actually the boat driver. So we should probably catch Chad up. So this is our running theory, Chad, because neither one of us have played this game. That the guy that brought us to this island, uh, this black dude and his daughter... Claimed to be Dumet. They were very jumpy. Uh, the daughter was like hiding in closets. We got here. They got back on the boat and they yeeted themselves back across the lake. So, uh, Jamie here, lovely, uh, saw it. And she's like, yo, they fucking yeeted out of here. Do I have a flashlight? Oh, fuck yeah, I do have a flashlight. Okay. Huh, finally! First character with a damn flashlight. Um... So then we start finding all these letters referencing a Joseph Morello. And he was invited here with Charlie? five family members. And it was basically his family members and his daughter. Complimentary horror <laughs> game flashlight. Well, no, 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 because Charlie's got a freaking lighter, not a flashlight. Um, Mark has, like, a flash cam. Camera. Yeah. You see a secret? Ooh, let's get those secrets. Oh, it's a picture frame. Wait, no. That's... Oh, wait, is that like a premonition? Oh, wait, no, no. What happened? It wasn't. I... No idea. Damn, it's fucking trash down here. Yo, this wasn't like this when we came in, right? No. Yo, there's blood on the floor. They changed the number. They changed the number. Wait, they changed the number? Okay, chat. What's the new number? 180? What was the number yesterday? I wonder if that groundskeeper would know where the map went. 0178. Okay. 
how do I, how do I, like, oh, there we go, inspect, okay. I feel like that's going to be a clue somewhere. All right, so yesterday we had 0178. Get all the shinies, all the shinies. Today, chat, we've got 10180. So, uh, let's keep those numbers in mind. I have no idea what they go to. Okay, I've got a, I've got a business card over here. Damn, I have some nice nails. There's a shiny on the floor. Hope you had a good holiday. Arasnon, welcome in. I did, I did. Um, ooh, two of five. Two, okay, two of five business cards found. Dude, there's fucking blood on the floor. Like, there is fucking blood in that closet. Okay, we're gonna inspect that closet last. Oh, fuck! I just had a premonition. Yeah, Charlie, Charlie gets stabbed with a meat hook. Oh. Don't tell me Charlie's gonna have, like, the most gruesome deaths in this game. Hmm, <laughs> that was pretty gruesome from what we've seen so far. Uh, the power. Well, I mean, he is kind of an asshole. Our luggage is still blocking the main doorway, which I don't know why we can't move that. Um, let's check the logbook. Okay, so... Yeah, here it is. The Morala family. Take a look at the check and then check out. Like, you see how the handwriting is. Yes. Check in. They've all got different handwritings. Check out. It's all the same handwriting. Like, they didn't even try to disguise it. What's this? You leave my script alone. That's our Bible. Of course you equate your notes to the Word of God. <laughs> British, love. All right, I'm, I'm gonna check these doors over here. I think we only have to check the two doors: the door at the other end of the hall, and then the blood door. Oh, are we doing something? What are we? What are we doing? Uh, no, my. Uh, I figured I had to check the same clues that you did to get out for my completeness, and it just paused when I looked at the hotel check-in and check-out book. Hmm. All right, so let's uh, let's examine that door at the end there. Yes. Just because I, I I think the blood door is, yeah, this door is locked. Okay, so we've examined everything in here, I believe. Uh, we gotta examine the blood door. Ready? Well, uh, does the streamer take charge or is it uh, the boss Charlie? Fuck Charlie! Hey, Charlie! He's a little bitch. Come here. Is. Look, I'm freaking the fuck out. It's paint. That it's ain't paint. It's not fucking paint. It's blood. Blood, Charlie. You're jumping to conclusions. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd. What do you want me to say? Look, it's probably just Dumet or the groundskeeper dragging in some dead animal from outside. Maybe it's our dinner. I. Uh, Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? What? So he hasn't left? That sounded pre recorded. Yeah. yeah, Charlie gotta go. Oh, Riven wants Charlie to die. But I thought we were going to try and keep them all alive. Our goal is to make sure everyone makes it off the island alive. Yo, I see more blood. Or if one person does die, it's Charlie. You see more blood? I feel like we should turn around. Go get, go get the others. Tell them to fuck their luggage. We can all buy new fucking clothes. And there's more blood along this wall here. Uh... Throw our shit out of the fucking way. We can buy more cameras. 
and get the fuck off this island. I like that idea. Unfortunately, this is a horror movie game, so we are not going to do that. Alright, so we got that overly dark hallway, or that overly dark hallway. You want to split up? <laughs> split up and search for clues. I got this one. Okay. I like how we're following all the tropes. <laughs> oh, I got something over here. Ooh, this has an official government seal on it. Internal memory. U.S. I hear someone struggling to breathe. You hear that? No. Someone sounds like they're. Where is that coming from? I'm gonna check out that secret as well. It's right at the end of the call hallway under the uh. You let me walk right into a jump scare yesterday. Okay, I found a room. It's where the music's loudest. I'm still concerned about that. Oh. 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 Alright, we check the door last. Check the room. Yo, I am not about this this life right now, like Alright, so this game, remember like the hide. I think we gotta do that'll be in the oh yeah, whatever. Yeah. This door we can possibly open. So we have our choice between the white door or this door over here. I think. Hold on. Gross. Oh, that's a fucking hand. That is a bloody fucking hand. I don't think this door actually opens. I think the inspects for the hand there. Oof. There's a bloody Ugh. hand on the floor. All right, so we got a. There's a handprint on that chair. There's blood on the wall. I am so proud of you. You saved the cinnamon bun. You hear that? Help the fuck? That's the groundskeeper. Help me. Please. Please. Are you? What happened? Are you okay? Stop. <gasps> what? Oh. Oh, damn. Bryce, it's, it's a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that plate, and this guy is getting run through by that thing. <gasps> oh. I feel like it was fake. Remember in Until Dawn where, um... Get the fuck out of here. 
Now. What's his face set up that Charlie. fake trap? Huh? Let's go. Yes. I don't know. But I I was gonna pull you off because I selected did, reach for you. Did you see him? The mask? What the hell was that? Those suitcases were on a presso crate. Jesus. We're trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door down. Right. On three. One, two, three. <laughs> you hear that? Yes. What is happening? We can look there. Fuck. <sighs> I find your spirit uh, crystal. I'm, uh, I'm Kate. Don't do that. Don't make fun of me. Sorry. Wouldn't want you to cut Fortnite battle pass? Sharp as hell and you know, super magical. I do not play Fortnite, so unfortunately I'm not sure about that. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I it's just a feel rock. like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop <laughs> outsourcing the job to a crystal. Any boulder, it's a rock. It's Tom. Maybe You're naming right. the rock, Tom. But you don't have to be an asshole about it. Oh, okay. okay, maybe that, that was a shitty thing to say. I'm okay. sorry. I guess that doesn't prove our relationship. It's fine. This isn't the time or place to. I have to tell you something. Well, what's up, babe? Okay. I hope you're, hope you're doing good, homie. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? I got, I got hydrated. It wasn't a job. I got juice. Really. What are you talking about? Wait, we're about to get a big lore drop. We were setting up a studio in Brooklyn. Be, uh, Fine arts. Uh, you wanted a partner. For both of us to redeem, to use That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought... You tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Why the hell didn't you go for it? Why didn't you tell me? Things were already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because... It would have taken me away from you. Aww. Aww. You've got to accept that. I, I, I guess I didn't even think of that. This option, so I had to do, like, the sweeter option. Basically, I think we're going to make them get back together. We are going to make them. We are all about love here on I, this channel. Except for Charlie. Just, except for Charlie. Fuck Charlie. The lesbians and them. What did you say? Guess I was holding out for things to change with this. It's like deep down, I'm still hoping. Mark, I have never once shied away from telling you where my priorities were. All right, I get it. We better go. Let's get back to Aaron and get the fuck out of here. That is a two-way mirror. I wonder how much pure amethyst is going for online these days. Amethyst helps keep Kate calm during calm events. Okay. So. We might need it just in case. I feel like in case if we get stuck in a corner or something like that. Do you think they found you, man? Charles seems hell bent on talking to him, so maybe, yeah. But, hey, thank you so much for dropping by. Like, I can't thank you enough, homie. Yes, welcome. Welcome to the party. Thank you. Thank you for coming. It's always a party here. Joe is currently, I believe, our longest running subscriber. Uh, yes. Is she? Yeah, she's 19. Well, legal, but... <laughs> hold on, hold on. Is there a way for me to actually check this? Uh, if, if, you, if, you, if you have, like, the screen, you can kind of say, like, on her name. I'm a moderator and a 19 month subscriber, and I just have my 18 month 
Oh, yeah. Huh. Well, uh, second longest running subscribe. All right, are we splitting up again? I know we just had that heartfelt moment, but I feel like we need to go our separate ways. Who's going around locking these doors? Uh, well, no, because there's a locked door. <laughs> Mind over matter. Yes, that's how asthma works. That's how recovering from COVID works. Wait. What's that? Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is it her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? <laughs> Don't. Who the fuck is Shelby? Nothing done the same. That's him. Oh, what? Okay. That's him. Uh, oh, I guess he's the guy a, in the back. You know him? Mm -hmm. Kinda did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. We'll be at some of the same parties, but that's it. Okay, let's go. We, we it was my fault. Just, you know, that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I think we have a co-worker that's like that. I slept through. It was a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and yes. that's when he, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! <sighs> <laughs> no, um... <laughs> button press, button press! <laughs> just happened I, I don't know but i think it's really really bad and this is why i carry knives on me so now what we're fucked i need to show you the danger leap yeah maintenance corridors crawl space has to be they are because aaron's room was oh apparently i'm charlie now okay All right, so to get to getting this guy dead. I mean, we're totally gonna keep him alive. Uh, what's going on, Jamie? Well, let's put that up to a vote to chat. Chat, who do you want to see live? Are we gonna split up? There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. If you prefer to keep Charlie alive, give it to if you prefer to keep Jamie alive. Let's think about this. You saw Dumet take off. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? <laughs> We've got two votes for Jamie. Perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? But, uh, girl, girly, girly friend, you have to do number one or two. That girly friend can do whatever girly up. friend wants. But that was planned out, okay, every bit she, of it. She has, she has an it was set up. She's a moderator. To find. Which makes That's it true. even more likely Everybody the dude on the ferry wasn't two. really Dumet. Did you find anything? No. Well, fuck, neither did I. There wasn't, like, anything. But, oh man, that button press thing, uh, like, it felt forced, like, no matter how hard we pressed, we both got separated. Yeah, yeah, I definitely feel that. Uh, okay, well, this feels like something you could expect. Hmm. 
Hopping into another DMs fight. I'll be back. Okay. Have fun, Arathanon. Thank you for the lurk. Thank you so much, Thank you so much for, for joining us. Dude, what the fuck? We are, like, completely trapped. Well, apparently, like, this hotel is, like, designed to trap people, like, in, like, rooms. I think we have to, like, find some kind of, like, secret way out or something. What's this on the wall? You found something? Uh, yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's a big shiny. Oh. Uh, let's see. I want to see if there's, like, any little shinies on this little table. Nope. Uh, did we walk a little bit before we check out that big shiny? Yeah, I'm just checking down yeah. here. Basically, if anybody's played this game, or played any of the games in the series, you gotta, like, check every corner and crevice before advancing to the next park. You don't... Going in a circle now. Yeah, we've, we've gone in a circle. Did we? we no, that. We're this. No, this is different. We didn't. We didn't pass down here before. This is different. Right? I'm trying to map this in my head. There's an open door down there. No, this is different. It's been completely cut off. Jesus, right. Charlie. Why is okay, so we got to go back and check that shiny because that's the front. way to progress. Is the that open door down there? Don't you watch our show. That's what these sociopaths do. Alright, where was the shiny at now? Why can I not progress forward? Hey, come tell me if you can progress forward here. I can't. I feel like there was a wall there before. I think it's the game's way of basically trying to prevent you from being too lost right now. Okay, here's the shiny. Oh, no. Seriously? Oh. This was one of Holmes's tricks. What are you saying? What does that mean? That we need to watch every step we take. Now, this is coming from the guy that, like, killed a guy. Indirectly. Alright. Poor groundskeeper, like, was just doing his own job. Probably getting paid minimum wage. Alright, so this, there, there's the door. Charlie is breathing so fucking hard right now, like... Well, he is a smoker, so I'm not sure if I have something to do with it. Where's my daddy? I'm not liking this. I don't, I mean, don't tell me this guy's murdered kids too. Wait, I thought murdering younglings was my job. Oh wait, we got I mean, two fucking shinies. Okay, we got a door. We've got something over here. Okay, this is an investigating. Oh, it's a coin! It's a coin. Yes. Hell yeah. Make and bank. Well, no, when one of us picks it up, it counts for both of us. We should have a. T Ooh! We make and bank. Alright. Are we ready? Jamie, over here. Help me with this. Okay. Oh. oh, it was a fucking trap. Oh! Oh my god. Don't go in there, don't go in there! Yes! Oh my god, we fucked up! We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. Okay. 
you know, a doll in a doll in a doll. Are you using um, shit? okay. Because I don't need that right now. If we we're, were smart, kitchen, we would grab one of these fucking meat hooks and beat the fuck out of whoever comes through that damn door. Out of this room. How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. Or off the island. Maybe we just focus on one thing at a time. This room first. You're right, of course. This, this, this is a body. This is a, there's a body here. That's a body. Like, I'm seeing plenty of weapons that I could use right now to defend myself, and I'm not allowed to pick any of them up. And here's the thing, like, earlier in the, earlier in the game, like, it's Jeff, freezing. Like, had, like, one punch, and, like, he took down the hole, so he didn't bother to take the nice fish to chop. Jamie, another door. I think this one actually gets us out. We have to get this open. That's not what I was expecting. Ah, ah. ah. Oh, fucking A. Don't tell me we're gonna be separated now. Aaron, okay. You're Aaron, I'm Jamie. Oh, okay. Are we gonna be reunited? I hope so. Okay, I think Aaron's gonna be using her oh, All right, I am trapped in a room right now. Actually, you're watching the stream. You can see what I'm seeing. Yeah. I just can't see what you're seeing. So I wonder if I play this by myself, if I would have to play through each individual character, like how you're playing through Aaron right now, or if that would just happen in the background automatically. Well, Aaron's still in a room, and I think the door just mysteriously closed. All right, remember, mind over matter, because that's totally how asthma works. Yes. Aaron, just remain calm. So many weapons. Aaron, please don't place my life in your hands again. Ah! Oh, fuck! Get off me! I I fucked up. I made it. I fucked up. Trash. All right, so you can use that to get out. I got three puffs of my inhaler. Oh, we got a number. Stop leaving the codes everywhere. Okay, chat. Okay, we've got another code. We've got a fifteen. 73. Okay, what are what are our codes for tonight? Um, what was that code yesterday? 01 And then we've got 0180 and now we've got 1573. 15 okay, I did the I did the smart thing and I uh, did the option of collect my inhaler from the killer because Aaron was about to have like a asthma attack in this new room and I helped her save from herself from an asthma attack. So I guess I made the right choice. All right, that's that's important. We've got we've got codes. We've got lore. Uh, yeah. Snake oil. I don't know if that has anything to actually do with. Okay. Uh, ooh, okay. Ooh, I found a medical report. Uh, Snake oil. Data for... You get to see the same clues that I see, but we're in different rooms so now. I think so. At patients are quiet. Twilight Perry retirement home. I meant blah blah blah. Advancement of cancer means surgery and other therapies oh, are on. Oh, okay. I found this one spooky room. It's like mannequins with like a doctor with like a syringe and a patient with like a mannequin with their mouth open. Guys, I found a safe. All right, I'm going to try that new code we just got. What was it? 1573? 
Let's see if this gives me... Let's see if this gives me a weapon. Can I have a gun? Oh! That, that code didn't work. Okay, um... Let's try the other codes from the other night. Zero... One... Seven... Eight? No? What? I found a tape recorder. Mm hmm. Uh, it says, like, it has Charlie's voice. And it said, I'll bring my team here this weekend. I want them all dead. Oh! <gasps> I want my team dead. I'll get them to you this weekend. Just do it. But here's the thing it's, it's a tape recorder, though, so I'm not sure. It's so been it's manipulated. Manipulated what he said. To try to get us to work against each other, because I feel like there's gonna be a, like a like a like an event later where we have to trust Charlie or like kill him. I feel like I should already know the code for the safe. I I kind of want to know what's really in the safe. Uh, let's see here. this game out before it came out like officially because they let me do like a trial of the prologue so you probably have to play everything by yourself the code's got to be in this room i feel this guy has an infatuation with homes right what year was the World Fair? What year was the World Fair? 1964. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Nine, one, nine, six. No. What year was Holmes born? What year was H.H. H. Holmes born? Okay, I think I see another either tape recorder or phone that can... 18 1 All right, real quick, we're going to pause. I want to review some of these secrets. I feel I like... Of, I found a lot of secrets on my side. I'm still trying to get into that safe. I also feel like I should just Google what the code is, just so we have what's ever in the safe. Okay, 1997. That's a four-letter number. Okay, 1998. So And apparently she's like Max that was like Charlie and Jamie. Which makes sense, but I don't think she's ever been alone with Mark. Alright. Chat, what do you think we should do here? Should we Google what the code is and get what's in the safe? Or should we give up on it? You'll 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 be our guide. I'm actually going to see. Oh. Okay. What? Uh, I'm just reading, like, the, the premonitions, like, well, or, like, the bearings. It confirms that uh, Jamie and Charlie realized that the man they was they met wasn't the real Dumet. 
Karen Clown a letter about Hector Monday's bad behavior at school. All right, the wifey says Google stuff. I am. I'm. I'm googling some stuff. All right, so let's see. Uh, according to Google, I now have the code, so I would just need you to hit continue, and then I will put the code in, and we will find out what's in the fucking safe. I don't know how they got this. Hold on. I want to know how they got this. The lounge. When you look at the memory, and the code is the year from the lounge box. What? Okay. I'm a genius. All right. What? Oh, I was hoping for a gun. In loving memory. Please join the funeral. Sir. Chat, I have a theory. Joe, would would you like to hear this this theory of mine? Okay, I want you to remember back to yesterday. We saw that cutscene of the old woman in a rocking chair. And we only saw the back of her head, right? Yes. I just found clues that indicate a medical report of somebody having cancer being so far advanced they could not operate or treat. The thing in the safe was a letter for a woman that had passed away. What if the Dumet is a, is a fake name? His name's not actually Dumet. What if the guy is the son of this woman who's been driven mad and he's building the mannequins and the woman we saw in the rocking chair yesterday was actually a mannequin and he's hallucinating the voice of his dead mother telling him to kill people? That, that is my theory. <laughs> I mean, the mannequins everywhere. And why else do you have all these mannequins? Lounge. Oh, I just got a key for the lounge. Wait, wait, there's something up here that I missed. <gasps> Reminder, see Dr. K if you've forgotten the new safe combo. Or, you know, I could just check Google. Alright. Talk to Google. Alright. So I've now fucked around in here for quite a while. Oh, oh, the lights are going. The lights are flashing. The lights are flashing. I don't like this. The lights have gone out now. Oh, fuck, I'm back to where I started. Okay. There has to be a door. That wasn't supposed to work, but okay. Is that a cutscene? Yep, I have a cutscene on my side. I have a cutscene on my side. Oh, oh no. Aaron. Aaron? Make her hide in the cupboard or I will kill her. Aaron, can you hear me? If you have the choice to hide in the cupboard, hide in the cupboard.
Hello, Aaron? Uh, Jamie? Can you hear me? What is happening? What? You're not safe, Aaron. How are... You have to listen to me. Do exactly as I say. Jamie, what is going on? Where are you? I don't... Just listen. Oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Aaron? There's a cupboard in there. You have to get inside right now. What are you talking about? Just hide, Aaron. Why are you telling me this? What's happening? Aaron, now. Just trust me, okay? Did you hide in the cupboard? Yes, they gave me an option to hide or run. Dead. Uh, okay. Jamie? Hello? Oh my god. I'm really glad Hopefully that somewhere safe wondering where the hell we are. Okay, check this out. <laughs> what is going on? Are, are we locked this in This is here? fucking tense. Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Yeah, what? I know, right? <laughs> like. Is that them? Where's it coming from? Like if I'm by myself, like. Somebody's in the restaurant. What's the plan, Charlie? You end up dead. But here's the thing. Oh, I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. Mark and Jamie. The two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite her bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? Uh, I'm just glad. Like, here's the thing, though. Like, uh, when I Mark, what are you doing? Game, just stay back from it. I saw their. I saw your phone. Mm hmm. Relax. Like, so, it's a bunch of mannequins dressed like us. Weird? Yes. Cause to lose your shit? No. I like a badass bitch, and then they gave me an option to be angry and ignore what you were saying about hiding, but I didn't do it because that would have killed Jamie. Or, I mean, that would have killed Aaron. Yeah, that didn't kill me. There's a shiny. That's mistake. I also have a shiny. My shiny's a coin. I got us another coin. Oh, damn, that was four coins. Has anyone seen Mr. Well, Dumet? Uh, to be fair, it didn't say, you know, you only can collect one coin. I guess some points of the game. Jesus, Mark. Even like it's dressed just one. like you. But here's the thing whoever the killer is, they have to be really playing with us because they could have killed Aaron right then and there. Who did they this, Mark? This is really freaking me out. I... Jesus. It looks just like it. No way somebody just threw these together in the last couple of hours. Okay, this is fucked up. What the hell is going on? I feel like... These games always have a supernatural component to them. Always. Right? So I'm wondering if... It really isn't home. Just to mess with us? Yeah, like what if it's 
somebody pretending to be him. Or somebody that claims to be possessed by him, or somebody that is possessed by him. Remember what Holmes said at the beginning of the game. The devil is in me. Bury me under concrete so that he may never rise again, or I will be back to kill because not even death can stop me. What if... Even if his mortal body was dead... He, he would... Yes. What if the guy in his sadness over his mother's death... You hear that? I, I was standing and talking to you! And they're getting closer. Okay, quick, grab a weapon. Okay, heartbeat. Jamie, yeah, you guys suck at being stealthy. Are you okay? I am not. This place is a fucking nightmare. Demet killed his groundskeeper. What? Right in front of us. We both had the breathe. It's a setup. He was wearing a mask, and I know how that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side Are you of the fucking lake, kidding me? Bodies... Dead. Jesus, Dead. shut Bodies. it up! Dead. 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 Yes. Yeah. <gasps> oh! That? That's an actual human eyeball. This. It's fake. A prop, or from an animal, or something. It has to be. No, 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 no way. That's way too real looking. She's gonna fucking touch it. Jamie, my girl! Oh, oh it's real. It's fucking real. I told you. This was all too much. Let's get out of here. What if that's a clue to how she dies? Yo. Like, <coughs> oh, it's locked. What's going on? The door I came through is locked too. <coughs> Do man. So, yeah, pretty You want to play around? Get out here. Right now. I couldn't really Let's fucking play. My neighbor had like a lot of smoke coming out of his house. Sucks to be him, doesn't it? My whole fire department and my police. Like, we're over. Well, the house wasn't burned down or anything, but. Oh, hey, Charlie. Uh, who's Charlie? Who's Charlie? I think it's the cutscene. <laughs> You're Aaron, I'm Jamie. Okay. Okay, well, I'm still on the Look. Charlie. Do not go in there. Do not go in there. Oh, Charlie's in a prison cell. <laughs> It said you were playing as Aaron. Uh, well, next thing, well, I'm Charlie in the basement. Find Charlie, okay. This is Charlie's. I've got, okay, I've got your goodbye. Oh, <gasps> it says goodbye. Did you find something? Charlie's lighter. His dad gave him this. He wouldn't just drop it. I'm playing as Charlie. Goodbye. Dumet wanted us to find it. No, 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 Yes. We gotta talk for a moment. Okay, we gotta talk. Okay. I'm in the prison cell. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know how it says find a way out? Mm-hmm. There's, like, a key hanging up on the wall. I feel like as soon as I get the key and, like, open up the door, it's gonna lead to my demise. Search everything before you touch the key last. Search literally everything else. Okay. We'll see if you can bide some time. Just, I don't know, stand there and look confused. But we're trying to get to you. Oh! <gasps> okay, I, I, I see you on a camera. Look! Years. Charlie! 
Is he all right? I think that was like previous footage. It is him. Like more down alley, my guy. We need to get in there before something happens. <laughs> oh fuck! It's a key code. Years are the wine, wine that fill up the cup of time. time. What? Check this out. It's a puzzle, a riddle of some sort. Makes sense, right? The tricks and traps. It's playing games. Yeah, not a fan of life or death escape rooms. I'm locked up in a room of the basement, and there's like a key that's. Let's think. Other than H.H. H. Holmes, who else played these sort of games? We can profile when we have the time and option. I'm trying to think of a way out of his game. Fine, but okay. right now, I don't see we have much choice but to play if we want to get out of here. Because here's the thing, like I told you, I was Aaron earlier, and like, they, like, you know, he told me to hide in the closet, right? Mm-hmm. And then like, you know, when I was in the closet... Green nine. You know, Okay, okay. Wait, hold up. I, I'm- we're- we're figuring out a puzzle to get you. Chat, remember, green nine. Green nine. Maybe it has something to do with these dates on the bottles. Uh, red one. Red one, green nine. Blank bottle, okay. <laughs> Red one, Star Wars. <laughs> Yellow six? Yellow six. Okay, so we've got green nine, red one, yellow six. We, we need one more number. One more number, chat. This is it. Last one. Blue eight. Blue eight. We've 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 got it. Blue eight. Okay. I'm coming, Charlie. All right. So it was red one. Blue eight. Uh, green nine. Right. And yellow six. Isn't that... Yes! That's it! What's he doing? Wait, what? I ended up in a different prison room somehow? So... What? It's Charlie, look. look I'm in a different room entirely. I don't know. Oh! <gasps> I think... What is this place? I didn't even do anything. No, I did. I'm sorry. Oh my... Oh, oh no. Don't... No, don't turn it on! What's happening? Look at this. It has to be connected to where Charlie is, right? Hey! Hey, You're in an oven! I'm here! Something is happening. We have to get him out of there. Yeah, but how? We don't even know where he is. Look. The vent's opening behind you. <gasps> oh. What the hell is that? It's one of those things. Wait. If there's gas in there. We gotta do something. No! Please! He's gonna cry. What do we do? Oh no. If we don't do something, Charlie's dead. No, Dumet wants us to pull it. It's another game. I don't trust him. He's just fucking standing there. Do something, Charlie. Oh, I think I just killed you. Charlie. Oh, I think I just killed you.
I did suppress it. I pulled the lever to save you. I, I could have saved you. I can. It's playing on the video feed. Oh my god! I'm, I'm, I shouldn't have pulled it. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have pulled it. Oh, I should have ignored it. I shouldn't have pulled it. Such an unpleasant way to go. I have to wonder how the group will fare without their leader. A fucked up chat. It can be difficult working with someone you've been involved with. But I, I think know. Mark and Kate may be finding a way and learning some new things about each other. And how do we feel about Mr. Dumet's lovely animatronics? I think they're rather clever. Some of them look very realistic. I wonder where he sources the parts. It would only be fair at this stage to offer up a little hint to even the odds. What do you think? Yeah. I thought that, yeah. Let's take some inspiration from the works of Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Apparently, our friend Herman Mudgett was so enamored with Sherlock Holmes that he borrowed his surname. Hmm. Here. <clears throat> He has a brain of the first order. He sits motionless, like a spider, in the center of its web. But that web has a thousand radiations, and he knows well every quiver of each of them. I hope that helps. No, it doesn't fucking help, you asshole. I have a theory about this, guys. You'd better get back to things. Best of luck. I have an overall theory about I'm gonna I'm gonna pause this real quick. I have a theory about the overall series of the Dark House anthology, the Dark Pictures anthology. I think the curator is death. Like like, you know, Remember Death from Supernatural, how he was, like, an actual, like, overall being? Yeah. I think the curator is Death himself. Death incarnate. The final destination, Death, Death. And we, as the players, are, like, spiritual reapers that are sent out to watch over these people and influence their choices. We We are supposed to be, like... We're, we're the angels on their shoulders, like, good choice, bad choice. <laughs> and depending on what choices we make, their souls get reaped. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm thinking way too hard about this, aren't I? But here's the thing, I'm not sure if I kind of fucked up, yeah, my... ...reported to that fire room without, like, any warning. I'm not sure if maybe I was supposed to expect myself to get my prison cell. But something tells me even if I escaped my prison cell, I probably would have walked into that insane room anyway. Yeah, no, that that fuck up was totally me. So I got you so <laughs> in our running bet, you still died first, and it's because I killed you. That that sums up our friendship perfectly. I'm like, but hey, the lesbians are still alive and well to be fair, as a whole five people, one person had to die. At least it was Charlie. Uh, yeah, fuck Charlie. <sighs> uh. <laughs> Man, I can't believe I killed him. Uh. I just, I wish we had gotten, like, a picture to, like, tell us. Because the picture we got... Shows Charlie dying to a meat hook, not like the incinerator. I thought that was the next possible death. I was I was counting on the meat hook thing. Oh, anyway, let's continue. Yeah, I feel like we have to have a different By the way, did you know Man of Meaden is multiplayer? So is Little House of Ashes. Apparently, the whole series is actually multiplayer. 
Uh, and the quarry. So anything that's not in the main... Wait. You hear that? Yeah. From down there. What if it's Aaron? No way. Damn it's it. It's another trap. It's the only way out of here. So, we're... Going to find well, out. We solved the puzzle, but... That's... One thing that would kind of keep Charlie alive. I think... I think it, uh... Mark, I see you can hold on to the switch. Uh... Uh, I, I, don't, I don't know. I feel like it's that's a really tricky. Is this a good idea? I don't see any other options. I have a camera, like a camera camera that I can take like photos with. Huh. Well, uh, at least we got rid of our fifth wheel. <laughs> I, I definitely feel like playing one more chapter. We are so damn invested in this right now. Yeah. Okay, can, who are you playing as right now? Jamie. Okay, Jamie, get your ass down here with the actual fucking flashlight. Uh, <laughs> Keep looking around. Yeah, I was like looking around to see the secret. I'm just trying to think how the hell you, you can keep, you know. I shouldn't have pulled the switch. I feel like you kind of had to, but like, I don't know, it's like, I feel like I definitely got more, like, a replay through this. Oh, definitely. I wonder what happens if you have, like, a full party of, like, four or five people. Unless you play with more than two people from the menu. Apparently, man of mediums uh, plays up to five people. Yeah, I think you can play like for like ev all of the playable characters. Which is going to be kind of awkward because, like, you know, you kind of switch between playable characters. Watch. Oh. Shit, man. Fucking A. Oh, fuck. I think we're going to miss the opportunity. I feel like my theory is true. Charlie was the first Columbus. I think you're correct in that. This is Laura at reception. What the hell? The Columbus Spa is now open for guests. We treat each and every one of our guests like a real world customer. Thank you for your support. He's watching us. But somehow I kept her alive. <sighs> so, I, I feel like Mark's definitely like main character energy because he hasn't had a chance to get killed yet. I know, right? Him and Kate. Yeah, so those two might be main characters. Oh, oh no. Oh, fuck. Please tell me that's a mannequin. Oh. That is not a mannequin! Yeah. Jesse Clark. There must be something useful around here. Yeah, because there's a dead body. Let's talk about the dead body. Alright, I'm gonna go explore up here. You explore that little hole in the wall there. What the fuck? Oh, that's a mannequin. Oh. That. Sweetie, that that's not a mannequin. That is a mummified body. I know, but I found the ID card next to it. Oh yeah, I I, I found that, but Who's that's that? not a mannequin. <laughs> that's a. Yeah, yeah, I, th I think I'm going the right way. I feel like the game's like, oh shit, you actually killed somebody. Uh, oh, we're gonna have to have a third person with you. Fear it back, me too. Okay, babe. I will attempt to not to kill anyone else. But th this seems.
seems to be how most conventions go. What's wrong? Um, oh wait, hold on. I have I have this camera thing that I can use. Oh, I can't look up there. My field of... What, what did... I don't know what she's looking at. Let's just keep walking without her. You're off tomorrow, right? Uh, nine to five. Oh, cool. Oh, to all staff, around. doctor, boiler room, ceiling collapse, no structural repairs, 350,000, boiler repair, 150,000, decor, 80,000. We can't what afford that. <coughs> nine to seven. I'm nine to seven all week. Ugh. Okay, so I don't I don't know what we're supposed to do. She's still staring up, like I feel like since she's like an NPC. Keep looking around. She's trying to give us like a hint. Yeah, but, like, we can't look up there. Well, I guess we have to find out how we can get up there. Like, we push something. Uh, we go around something. Well, I don't, like... <sighs> There's nothing up there. <laughs> like, I'm trying to... Yeah, like, she's literally looking at broken glass. Lovely. There must be something useful around here. Alright, so she's trying to give a hint. Like, there must be something useful around here. Uh, I wish I had an actual flashlight. Well, that was Holmes' whole thing. Holmes was all into, like, the psychological torture before he killed his victims. Anything? Actually, pretty stuck right now. I like. I'm not sure what we're supposed to be doing. I don't know where we're to be. Like we've checked all the shinies. We followed every path. Ah, <laughs> uh, am I going to pull out the Googles? No point just standing around. Well, you're the one that's standing around, bitch. I found a door to go through, and you're just standing around. I think we, I think we need to check the Googles. <sighs> I can't fucking breathe. Keep looking around. <laughs> no. Okay.
There must be something useful around here. It says there's a small shimmy section. Oh, hold on, I got something. By the way, I don't count using Google as cheating because some of these games you can literally get stuck for hours trying to figure out what to do. Like it. Yeah, no, I haven't looked up that. I've just looked up um, because like that that code that I looked up to, the answer was actually in 